Morning, everybody. I ran to Target and Walmart today because Target was 90% off and Walmart was 75. I'm going to start with what I got at Walmart. <clears throat> I got this red and polka dotted yard steak. It was $4.98. I believe I paid like a dollar something for it. And then I got this striped one, which is cute. And it was $5.98. And I also paid like a dollar twenty-five for it. And I'm going to be honest, I don't know where my receipt is. If you guys have followed me, you know I lose my receipts all the time. And then I got this. Nine foot black garland. This is really cute because I can use it for Halloween also. So that was a win. And I would say about, I don't even know, so I don't even care. And then I got this seven days of mask and advent calendar that I'm going to give to one of my girls next Christmas. Cute little gift. And then I got this Jurassic World soap and scrub Dino Berry set. This I know was like a dollar twenty-five. I'm gonna give that to my grandson for Valentine's Day. Just to get a little something something. And then I got this. I don't know how well you guys can see this, but it is let's see. Is this better? It's a romantic florals bass set. It was fourteen ninety eight. I don't know why this thing is not focusing. But I only paid like I would say like four dollars for it. I'm not even sure you guys, so I'm not even gonna tell you the prices. But I'm gonna give this to one of my girls for Valentine's Day. And then I got this. Another one, Romantic Florals. So, that is my cat in the background turning up my carpet. She thinks it's a, a cat post. Don't know. But, yeah, so I got two of these for two of my older girls for Valentine's Day. So, I'm happy with that. Now, I found this blow-up light bulb. For some reason, when I grabbed it, I thought it was an inflatable. But no, you need an air pump for that. But I already have an air pump, so I'm not mad at that. I am going to try to find some way to weigh it down so I can keep it outside. <clears throat> and then I got two of these blow-up giant ornaments. Guys and girls, when I went into the store today, and I went in late. I went in at like mm, about 9 o'clock, I think. There were women in there with carts and carts filled. So the inflatables that I want, someone already got there. Hey, I mean, that's what happens when you sleep in. And this is also a blow up, so you also need a air pump. So as long as I can find a way to weigh these down, I'm going to put them outside. I think they're really cute. My snowman inflatable, the fan's not working. So if I can find a fan for it, I will try to replace it. If I cannot, then I'm going with these. But yeah, I'm really happy I found these. So I paid, you know, about for three of these, I paid about the price of one, just about. And then these, I'm happy for Valentine's Day. Because they don't really speak Christmas to me. So that's what I like about it. Oh, and also, when I was at the store this morning, some of the stuff was not ringing up. 75% off like they had to manually enter in the system and they were working on some of our registers So I don't know what that was about Now hold on. I got some gift sets. So I'm gonna pull out one second guys Okay, I'm back. So I got this cup for my daughter for next year. Christmas is magical a nice little, you know fancy smancy unicorn. I think it's from the um Black paper party I'm not sure but this was trying to ring up 49 cents. Sorry about that. was my phone. This was trying to ring up 49 cents. Only half off. So they gave it to me for 22 I think. The lady at the register was really nice. Like, she was just like, what do you think? And I was just telling her price. Now I got this gift set. A stainless steel travel mug. Army. I might give this to my husband next year. I'm not sure. Or my step-grandson because he likes Army things. And again, this was not ring. This was trying to ring up for something, but they gave it to me for, I want to say one or two. I don't even know, guys. 
you know, I throw my receipts away as soon as I scan them. <laughs> and I got this for my daughter. Because she likes tahini. So, I thought this was really cute. And I might even give this to her for Cinco de Mayo because it's so cute. Like, I was like, ah, oh, I couldn't leave it there. I'm not afraid. I didn't even see this in the store when I went there. And I got this Christmas ornament for my stepdaughter because her favorite color is gray. So, I thought that was kind of pretty. That was like 10 cents. It was not a lot at all. And then I got this. Flipchit, I might give this out to one of the kids for Valentine's Day. I'm not sure. Because I don't know if they'd like that. And, again, I don't know how much it was. Like, I just picked up some stuff and threw everything in my cart. And I got these four candle clamps that you stick onto the window, which I really like. So I'm hoping I can find some more when they go to um 90%. Because it would be great if I could snag a bunch of boxes of these for, like, 34 cents. But yeah, guys, when I went in there late this morning, people had like two or three carts. I'm lucky I found any of this stuff. And then I found this. Two pack mugs. Cute. To give to my stepdaughter or my husband. Split them up or keep them. I don't know. And they were not $5.98. I knew that. Um, so this was 75% off. These are cute. This was like the last one I saw of those. And then Star Wars, Chewbacca. This is only a couple dollars. I had to grab it. This was the only one I saw there. And I didn't even see this during the regular season. So I don't know if somebody bought it and brought it back or what. But I have Star Wars lovers in the house. So that is not a problem. Now, guys, I'm mad at this. You see this beautiful cup, Holly Jolly? It came with a coaster. Little did I know that it was taped because the coaster was broke. But I'm not mad at it because this only rang up a dollar. I should have known better when it rang up a dollar and everything else was ringing up really high. But, you know, the excitement of the rush, it is what it is. And then, of course, always got to get the Starbucks. Someone always gets a Starbucks cup for me. Always. If you saw my one of my last videos, I got the Starbucks travel mugs, too. So, somebody's hit the jackpot with that. And then these are for the little kids. I told them this year that I was not getting them the plastic cups anymore. They're too old for that. So have a merry scotch. Squatchmas. I don't know if you can see that. I have a cute, it's a cute little tumbler. I may give that to them at the beginning of December. So they can take it to school. As a water mug. Squatching. Through the snow. And how much were these? These were like 62 cents, and I don't know why. Because I can I can definitely tell you, these rang up 62 cents, and I like these for Christmas time. They have little drinks on them. Hoping I can find more. These rang up 62 cents, and but these weren't ringing up, and the lady was like, you know what, I'll just give it to you for 62 cents. I do remember that, because I was like, thanks. And then another one. So I have started Christmas shopping. Yes, yes, yes. And now, look, guys. My one little frivolous buy that I bought. They're going for the kids. The dragon. Dino well, this is dinosaur. Dinosaur hand puppet. If you can see that. That was like a dollar. I had to get it. And then the dragon one. So cute. So I did not pay that much. I think I paid like maybe $25, $30. For all this stuff, like all the prices have gone out of my head because I was busy shopping, running in and out of stores looking for anything. But I got some stuff for Valentine's Day, which I'm happy about. Started my Christmas shopping, which I'm very, very happy about. Now, on the other side, I'm going to show you what I got from Target. So hold on one second. Okay, I'm back. Um, I found this also that I found at Walmart. It's 12 days of Star Wars. It's got socks, bandanas, patches, pins, and more. I thought this would be really cute. I have no idea who I'm going to give it to. But we got Star Wars lovers in this house, so I'm not mad at that. And that came from Walmart. And again, I never saw this during the regular season, so I don't know. Okay, so now I want to Target. I got one, two, three of these for a dollar. It's got four bells, a long garland, a black star 
white snowflakes and black garland. It's cute. I'm going to give this to my stepdaughter. Um, I don't really need any more decorations. I am taking the snowflakes out because I need a pro I need them for a project. So she can have the rest. I'm going to take those out. But for a dollar, and yes, Target was at 90%. Some of the stuff is not ringing up. And my Target still had the signs up for 70%. So I'm not sure. Just keep an eye out, guys. Now I got this native deodorant. It is sugar cookie and toasted marshmallow and vanilla. I picked some of these up yesterday and they rang up 70%. When I went today, they tried to ring them up full price. I'm like, no, it is Christmas. It's supposed to be 90%. So the lady was like, I don't know. I said, well, ask the manager because I bought some for 70% yesterday. I can show you my receipt, show you my receipt. He begrudgingly did it. I'm not sure why. I don't know, but I don't know if they were not supposed to go onto the sale price, but I was like, no, here's my receipt from yesterday. I wanted 90%. Um, I definitely know who I'm giving these to because two of the children said they liked each one of these flavors. So Christmas for next year, maybe beforehand. I don't know. And that was like 59, 90. I don't even remember. Okay. So these are some ornaments I got. Cute. It has a little heart on that says 2022, but I figured I could just turn that over. No big deal. And this was 50 cents. This was 30 cents. We have a tree that's red and white, so that can go on that tree very well. And don't mind the crinkles, another ornament. I got this ornament for 50 cents also. Again, it has a star. It says 2022. Just flip it around. No one's going to know the difference. If you do, who cares? It's an Alice and Hawkins. I love it. I actually love this. It reminds me of a old time ornament family thing. I just love it. So that's probably be mine. And this one will probably be my baby girl's unless I find her a better ornament. This heart is 30 cents. I got two of these, matter of fact. 30 cents. And sorry, the camera's everywhere. I'm going to use this for another project. That's why I got them for Valentine's Day. But I mean, if you want to put them on your Christmas tree, you have like a silver or gold Christmas tree. Hey, you can just kind of leave it like that. But for 30 cents, I was not leaving them. Not at all. And then I got one, two, three pairs of socks for 30 cents also. The penguins. Cute. Santa. Black Santa, white Santa. So, these were men's socks, 6 to 12. Some of the women in my family have big feet, so they can wear these. 30 cents each. Was not letting them go at all. And this bath bomb was 50. So, I'm going to give this to one of the older girls. Because my youngest girl already have has a... 12-day advent calendar of bath bombs just waiting for her to get wrapped. And I got this little doggy mail truck for 30 cents. I couldn't help it. It was cute. And then this was 30 cents also. A little gray sweater with gold on it. I may give that to my stepdaughter. She loves gray. I don't know. Now, the biggest thing that I got... Well, not the biggest thing, but the next biggest thing I got... I got a puppy for Christmas this year. She is a little tiny thing, but look what I found for $1.50. A red puffer coat, medium puffer vest. Keep her warm. She'll wear it out when it rains. Not going to kill her. I got that in a medium. And then I got that in an extra large in case that's how big she is. I'm not sure how big this doll is going to get. So, we will see. But I figure for a dollar fifty each, I'm not complaining. Mm -mm, mm -mm. All right. And the last thing I'm going to show you, I'm going to put you guys on hold for a second. Okay, guys. This is the last thing I got. I got a pile of stockings. Now, um, I don't know if I've said this in the previous video, but the older I get, the less knickknacks I want in my house. Like, I'm done with it. So, this year, I just put some pictures on the wall. And I hung some stockings going up 
the haul. I didn't even give my girl stockings because I did something a little creative. Like last year, I found this um, Christmas tree stand with holes cut out, and you can put like drinks or whatever. It goes for wine bottles, but I um, put my kids' gifts in there, and it's kind of like a punch out game. Now, it was kind of a fail because I didn't set it up right, but next year it's gonna go right. So, I'm just putting stockings on the doors, stocking in the windows, stockings on the walls, and it's like a nice, tasteful, Christmassy, homey feeling for me. So, I'm not mad about this. Okay, this was from the dollar spot, I think. No, maybe not. Okay, but this was 50 cents. So, you know, if you want, you could take this and put a little patch on it or someone's um, name. Real easy, 50 cents. I'm sure you can get a fine, an iron on. The rest of these stockings are $1.50 because they were 15. They were 90% off. I got this one, which my daughter might be able to use this for cheer for next year. They always give, like, stockings or whatever. I don't know. Fuzzy socks, whatever. So my husband's like, ooh, I like that one. So if I can find any more of those, I'm going to grab some. And then I got this. A nice little stocking. But it's got a little dog print or cat print, which is funny, but I don't need it. So I can cut that off. And then this one. Like a little three-tone knit. Kind of reminds me of the old-time um stockings back in like the 30s and 40s where people made their own in this one cute if it ever gets like really cold outside guys i'm slamming my feet in these stockings because look they're nice and um lined on the inside hold on look they're nice and lined i can definitely put my feet in here if fire electric goes out although right now it's like 50 plus degrees where i'm at which is crazy because two weeks ago it was like in the t like the teens, like I'm not even playing. And then I got this stocking, dollar fifty. Oopsie. And then I got this stocking, which is tied up with another stocking. But this is cute. And you could use this for Valentine's Day if you wanted. If you wanted to get creative, like put somebody's Valentine's present in there. I don't see why they would have a problem with it, because it's pink, a light red, and a dark red. All the nice little Valentine's cover colors. Now, come on, y'all. And it came with, a, like, a little poof. I might cut the poofs off and make a toy for my cats. Because we got a dog this year, a puppy this year, and a kitten this year for Christmas. So, And then this one. This is, like, a nice little argyle sweater going on. It's got the two little puffy balls. And then this one. Oh, it's another one with a pet paw. Can cut that off. Nice little sweater pattern. And then this one. It's cute. So that is my haul. I don't believe I'll need anything else. Um, I'll wait till Walmart goes on 90% because I kind of want to get my stepdaughter a white Christmas tree. I doubt that I'll be able to do it. They have one at 75%, but I was like, I have too much stuff already. I kind of went over my budget because... Of the gift sets. And I was like, I don't want to spend that much this year. Because like I said, I'm getting rid of stuff. I'm just keeping my lights, my trees, my ornaments. All my other knick-knack stuff, it's gone. I just, I want to get down to like a tote and a half where I want one of my totes to be half empty. So I can just take it out, put it on the wall, and be done. So I think this is a nice little Christmassy solution to that. You just have, you know, stockings on the kids their stockings on their door stockings on you know all the bathroom doors bedroom doors going up the hall in the hallway and then the living room you know just nice little touches not too much but okay guys so if you're out and about please go to walmart and know that it's 75 percent. some of it's not coming up have them change it at the register if you hit up target it's 90 percent. and like i said some of it's still not coming up um I actually had one more thing, but my oldest daughter, she took it and ran with it. I found one of those oil cooking sets. It's chef Aline, That was for um nineteen ninety nine. I had to fight for that to get put down to 90%. I'm like, it's Christmas. It's supposed to be 90. So that was $1.99. She took that and put that in her tote for college. So whatever. But I don't think I did too bad, especially with the dog stuff. Oh, wait a minute. I got 
my puppy a dog bed for six nine nine. I remember this because they were heck of expensive. I got this one and I got a huge gray one that's downstairs. So she definitely has a bed for where she is. Both for like six nine nine. I was happy. I was like, yes. I'm gonna try to wait until Walmart hits ninety percent and get the dog and cat stockings for next year since we now have a dog and we have two cats. So try to keep them entertained and not kill each other. But again, guys, there's stuff to be had and it's amazing. Like the other day I found two of the vampire. Hold on, let me show you. Yeah. The other day I found these. Six nine nine Halloween in the Christmas section. These people tried to make me pay six ninety nine for them. I said, no, they are Halloween. They don't even come up in your system. I want them for 90%. They're like, no, 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 no. I said, no, get the manager. I'm not playing with y'all. Y'all made me lose my cups last time. You're not making me do this. But I'm like, why are they still finding these stuff? The only thing I can think of is people are bringing stuff back. So they're getting put back on the shelf. So like I said, don't front. If you don't find what you're looking for right away, just keep looking and looking and looking. Go down the clearance aisle, clearance section of every holiday because I was never expecting to find these, ever. So, got two more little Halloween bugs I could do something with for the next couple years. They're supposed to glow in dark. I don't really care if they do because they're cute. I can keep this for myself, give it as a teacher gift, give it as a daughter gift. I don't know. I might give this to my daughter on her 21st birthday. The Halloween before her 21st birthday. Because that's like in two years. So maybe. I mean, I can keep stuff. But yeah. So, like I was saying, definitely make sure you're scanning the products, checking the prices at the register, because some of them are not even coming up to 75 or 90%. Remember, Walmart's 75, Target's 90. Happy hunting, guys. I'll see you guys later. Bye.